Mickey Roman was always ready to say goodbye to his mother, just not like this. You're waiting for the call in life to say that your mother passed, but you don't want to get the call in life to say your mother was murdered. Nobody understands when a person passes of natural causes, you can accept that. But when a person's life is taken for no reason at all, and in a way that they did it, they, they duct taped their hands or feet in their mouth, that's, that's murder. A senseless murder, which happened inside his childhood home. That's a hard thing to do to go to your mother's home, in your home, that you grew up in and have to take crime scene tape off for somebody doing a horrific act to somebody in that home. Roman telling our Kelly Brennan, it's not hate he feels in his heart for the person responsible for taking his mother's life. I feel sorry for the people that did it. My mother's gone. I can't bring her back. But maybe somebody has some grief in their heart or in their family that would say, you know, you should go face up to what you did. And now Mickey is left without his mother and without answers, as a special time for both is about to begin. We always talked about the football season coming. She says, you know, Stewards don't look too good last year. Maybe it'll get some better players this year. Meantime, police are still investigating the theory that Amelia's death was not a random act, as someone may have staked out her home and targeted her. We'll, of course, continue to follow this investigation.